Hello all, Namaskaram. This is Dr. Chandrika Saravanan, Consultant Reproductive Medicine, Craft IVF Center, Kochi. Today I am here to discuss a very common topic which is called ICSI. ICSI is a brief terminology for intracytoplasmic sperm injection. Now, how does an ICSI differ from a regular IVF? ICSI is an advanced form of an IVF procedure. In regular IVF, many sperms which are taken from the man is placed alongside with the egg in a culture dish in the hope one sperm goes and fertilizes the egg. So what happens in a regular IVF? Many a times we don't get an embryo formation which is called the fertilization failure. But in ICSI what we do is to select one of such sperm carefully and inject them into the oocyte with the help of a microscope. So who are the patients who need ICSI? They are patients with a severe male factor infertility where there is an abnormally low sperm count or a motility or abnormal morphology of sperm. Men with azoospermia that is complete absence of sperm in the semen. So what we do for such patient? We do surgically retrieve the sperm and do an ICSI procedure. The other extended uses can be ICSI for a frozen egg or a frozen sperm. When you want to do a genetic diagnosis of the embryo formed, then ICSI is the latest procedure. So ICSI guarantees a fertilization rate of around 85%. So I'm sure ICSI is a great technology which helps persons that is a woman or a male with severe infertility to use their own gamete that is the egg and the sperm to get pregnant. Thank you.